Good morning. Sit back, relax and let us wet your weekend with starting with 90 minutes of fantastic food from some of the world's best chefs. This is Saturday Kitchen Live. And welcome to the show, cooking with you live in the studio this morning. Uh, two of the most exciting chefs in Britain today. First, a man whose incredible Icelandic inspired menu has helped him retain his shiny Michelin star for a second year from the London restaurant Texture, it's Aggie Sverison. And next to him, another man with a coveted Michelin star hanging above his kitchen at his Nottingham restaurant that just happens to bear his own name. It's the ever so modest Mr. <laughs> Sat Baines. Good morning to you both. Morning. morning. So, Aggie, what are you cooking first then? Icelandic cod. Yes. Cauliflower and barley couscous and lemon dressing. Lemon dressing, and yes. it's a simple one. It's made with the rind of a lemon. Yes, this is beautiful. And Icelandic cod, of course. Of course, Icelandic seaweed as well, of uh, course. Right, and couscous, instead of using the old couscous, you do know with, with barley. Yeah, and cauliflower, yeah. Right. So, similar texture and uh, similar size. And in all your cooking, no butter, no, no cream. Butter. Forget it, forget it. There you, go. there you go. And follow that. And I'm kind of going all across Europe before then and afterwards, so England is right bang in the middle of Are the Are you going tour. to Iceland? Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm why sorry. Not? Why not? See, you may I've have been, seen with I the went... Icelandic cod, but you ain't yeah. got pretty belly with this thing. Sorry. <laughs> not going to Iceland. But anyway, you're here to eat. Right, let's get cooking. I'm waiting at Hobbs. It's a man whose Icelandic background has helped him create a very unique style of food at his London restaurant texture. It's Aggie Sverison. Great to have you back on the show. Thank you. Now, Great I'm only joking about the butter and the cream because Good. the, the flavours of your type of food really stand out. Yes. Um, quite clean, fresh, sharp. Sharp, clean, yes. fresh. What are we cooking yes. then? What's the name of this dish? Icelandic cod. Yep. Yes. We're going to do some uh, couscous of uh, cauliflower yep. and barley yeah, yep. with some nuts. And then we're going to do some lovely lemon puree. Which you you're want gonna me to do, do, you're gonna do that? Yes. Yeah, I see that. We're going to get on that. You brought the ash back with you. Of course, well, of you? course. Right. Of course. Okay. Well, Fire away. You're going to get so, the, uh, the fish on. Yes, I am. Now, this, uh, this zest here, the idea is you, you peel this with no white on it. You want just No the... white on it. Yeah. Right. Take the bitterness off. Yeah. You're going to blend set for about four to five times. So it's going to take 10, 15 minutes. So the idea is you bring it to the boil. Yes. Take it off. Yes. Put it back under the heat, bring it to the boil, take it off. Always using yes. fresh water. Yes, yeah? yes, yes. I won't be waiting 10 minutes because we've got one that's here, which is this one. So why do you need to do this five times then? Why because at the end of the day, you, you lose all the bitterness from uh, the zest. Right. It's very important. You get the, the sweetness. And what you want is, you, can, you know exactly when it's ready, when you can eat it, and it's almost no texture in it at all. Right. If okay. that makes sense. And no bitterness either. Very similar to sort of candy in it, you keep doing that as well. That stock syrup, yeah. Yeah. So into a blender. So Icelandic cod. Yes. The best in the world, obviously. The best in the world. <laughs> yeah, very sustainable as well. But there is the reason for this is because it's it's the the waters are nice and cold and cold cold water fish. Exactly, very cold. A lot of um, uh, salt as well yep. in the tea. So it's absolutely best of the best. Okay, basically. best of the best. Okay. Right, you're going to fry that off. Yeah. And in here now we've just put some sugar and some salt in there. Yes. And a bit of water. Water. And lemon some juice. Lemon juice, and that's it. Yeah. Okay. And I'm going to blend that. Cut course in the pan. The idea with the cod is you're gonna only cook it on one side, get it right. nice and crispy for about three minutes here in the oven for two minutes, take it out, ready, basically. Okay. okay. So just in oil, yeah? Just in oil, okay. no butter, unfortunately. Are you sure? Yeah. Right. Okay, that's so that's cooking away. Now tell us away. about your barley then. Yeah, so the barley, basically, this is gonna yeah. do next. That goes here. So barley goes here. Yeah. Water. And you cook this for about 20, 30 minutes on a si simmering. You don't need to soak that or anything? No, 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 no. Straight away. You cook with barley in your restaurant, don't you? Yeah, I think it's a great, uh, almost like a pork. Some sauce. Take away Off some we go. Rice. And also, it's, they do it with pork at the moment and pickled right. turnip. Really fresh. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, chicken back there if you want to wash your hands. Thank you. Lose this out of the way. But do you soak yours as well? It... No, so we do it again, we do it in the pressure cooker. Right. It's amazing. You've got a new gadget this year, haven't you? You just use it all the time, right? Okay. So none of you don't black pepper that? Nothing? Just no, 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 no. Just a little salt, that's it. Right, okay. And then lemon juice goes in here. Yeah. And then we puree this. Puree is right. to a fine puree. Very fine puree. I've been told, haven't I? There yeah. you go. So, lid on. Yeah. Mix it. Mix. Just keep blending it, blending it. That's all you do, yeah? So, tell us about your restaurant then, because uh, last time you were here, you just, just opened. 
Yeah, sort of. Yeah. But well, we are doing very strong. We've done very well. Last day was brilliant for us, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's just been doing really, really well. Right. Really, really pleased. What's that? Oh, what was that? <laughs> what was that? You want some oil in here as well? Yeah? Yes, please. Take this off. Why do I always get the jobs like this? Sorry? Nothing, I can't hear anything. That's getting finer anyway. Do you want me to fry off these little nutty things? That would be great, please. Are you going to chop them? Yeah, you need to chop them a little bit, yeah? Okay. Please. You're going to do that for me, please. How is it? Smoother, please. What have we got here? Cashew nuts, almonds, and uh, pumpkin seeds. Right, okay. Now we chop this up. So, where does your inspiration come from for your menu? Because, uh, like you say, no butter, no cream, and it's the thing that you really stick by. Yeah, in the end of the day, I started trying it out, and for me, I think it's better. You get cleaner, fresher flavours, yeah. and uh, for me, it's no, no turning back, basically. Right. No way. Don't get me wrong, I love going out to eat and get some butter, but yeah. my food, no. Right, a little bit of oil in here. Please, please, please. No butter? No butter. Just checking. Okay, the coat goes in the pan now for about two minutes. That gets fried off. That's good. Is this ready yet? Yeah, it should be. Should be, should be, should be. So, the barley here. This is cooked. It's done. There you go. Remember, if you'd like to ask a question on the show, then you can call this number. That's 0876 41 41 41. Calls, remember, cost 10 p a minute for a beating line night. Mobiles and other networks may vary. And a few of you to put your questions to us live a little later on. And also, you can find Aggie's recipe and this lemon sauce, along with all the other studio recipes from today's show, on our website. Go to bbc.co.uk forward slash Saturday Kitchen. Right, because we didn't hear a word of what was going on no, over there. Exactly. That so the fish is gone in the oven. Yes, in the oven. But skin, for about still the skin tied down. Yes. Right, yes, okay. yes, 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 yes. Right. There you go. Or rather, you've taken the skin off, but it's all on one side. All on one right. side, yeah. Toast okay. these off. Now, how long does this cook for in here? Well, 35 minutes there. Yeah. So here, we just heat it up, basically. I don't okay. want to cook the cauliflower. It should be very uh, crunchy, basically. Right, and then you want a little bit of this, these herbs. Yes, please. In here, uh, we've got what? Chervil, dill, parsley. Right. That's good. That's perfect. Now, thinking about Icelandic food, we've gone to Australia and had ants backside. <laughs> what about Icelandic food? Because you do have an unusual dish out there. Rotten shark, it's beautiful. Have you tasted that? Uh, I've tasted no. it. What's yeah? it like? Yeah, it's, it's great, no? No. no? <laughs> no it's <laughs> quite a set, at least. I had it's it with good. a shot of vodka. Yeah, black death then, or? Yeah, I think. Yeah, that's, be be that's beautiful black as well, isn't it? Yeah. Sounds good, we've got it. So explain, <laughs> explain to us, because there's going to be people waking up on a Saturday morning who probably want to turn over at this point with a hangover, what is that shark thing all about? So basically, we bury the shark for about six months, right? right? Around uh, the sea. Doesn't sound good already. But go on. Well, it's beautiful. It gets better. You and bury it in what? Just in the sand, by the sea. Right, OK. And then we hang it and let it dry for another six months. So it takes, it's about a year's process. <laughs> and after that, it's just beautiful. If you have the black death with it. If you just do it on its own, it's not that great, in all fairness. Uh, by the way, you probably need to drink about half a bottle before you start going to shower. So, yeah, it's so then it's really, really good. It's right, really I'll good. go get the What's fish the, What is the black death? Is it a liqueur? It's, it's or like a spirit? cumin uh, spirit, ah, cumin, so about 50%. 50, yeah. 50 and what's the shark like? Is it dry mm. like ham or...? Sorry? The, yeah. the shark. It's rotten. Mm. <laughs> yeah, it's basically <laughs> rotten. And, it, you know, have you, uh, like, a skate? Ah. Off, off skate, but skate is about, yeah, it's about 100 times worse. Oh, lovely. Yeah. So delicious. if I buried you for six months and they only you dry for six months, you wouldn't look too good either. But <laughs> right, you've got to add to the herbs for that. Yeah. This fish is there. Is it? Maybe there. No, a little bit longer. Another on. minute. Another minute. <laughs> Another minute. Right, explain to us what's happening here. Okay, so the herbs are going in here. Yeah. Plus a little bit of the lemon puree. Okay. More olive oil here, please. There you go. And it's there, really. And that's it. Now, other dishes that this would work with, instead of the cod? All fish, really. All fish? All fish, yeah. yeah. All fish. Well, All fish. Salmon. Vegetarian, oh, yeah. it's beautiful vegetarian <laughs> as well. And the, the cauliflower that you've got in there, it's not cooked? It's not cooked. Just warmed. Right. It gives it lovely texture. And I mean, cauliflower is beautiful this time of year. I mean, it's so sweet. Yeah. Fantastic. 
Right, I'm going to go get that fish out. It's ready, is it? It's not far off. There you go. Turn it over. Nice. Careful, careful. Careful, I'm careful, careful. Beautiful. There you go. Yeah. We're ready when you are. Yes. So there you go. Thank you. Yeah. So can I do like that? Yeah. Perfect. It's a fancy plate. It is a fancy plate, isn't it? Yeah. Thank it's you. all about nature. Okay. You always think about nature in Scandinavia. Did you bring your own plates, have you? Yeah, I did. Actually. Oh, thank, thanks. I don't know what told me. I always think about nature, but you go and bury it for six months. <laughs> That's part of the nature, isn't it? <laughs> right. Fish on? No. No. Fish on. No, 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 no. Thank you. Yeah. That's on. You scatter this around. All right. And the idea is with fish, you cook it on one side, you get that nice crispy yes. part to it. Yes. Exactly. Okay. Then we're going to put a little bit of olive oil here. Squeeze a lemon, please, James. There you go. So tell us about these other bits that you're about to put on as well. What's go. that? What's these other bits? Yeah, so we have this fresh little lovely rocket. Yeah. It's beautiful. Four ads we have, and our lovely seaweed, obviously. Yeah, straight on. Straight on. Seaweed, and this isn't any normal seaweed. No, that's surl. Special surl. Icelandic surl. They say it's the best in the world. We Icelanders. You've got a lot of things that are the yeah, best yeah, in the world. I was going to say, we Icelanders, we think everything is the best, best in the world. Volcanoes in the world, isn't and, yeah. and then. And then, then what? Then what is volcanic it? ash. Exactly. It looks like. Want to taste? Which is dried seaweed. And that's Beautiful. it. That's it. So remind us what this again? Icelandic cod. We have uh, barley and cauliflower couscous lemon dressing. Best in the world. Best Australia. in the world. <laughs>yeah, I absolutely love it. So it's well, you're very not going to get any because it's going to come this way. Very, 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 healthy for you. <laughs> very healthy for you. Yeah, it's gorgeous and the texture is really nice. Yeah. Sounds good to make. Nice. You just want yeah. bread and butter with it. Right. Now. Well, somebody's enjoying it anyway. I'm yeah. absolutely <laughs> loving it. It's a good job they're in a pattern on the plate as well, isn't yeah. it? That really was. <laughs> that just disappeared as well. Yeah, it? it's so delicious. It, lo just... it looks delicious. It looks delicious. What do you reckon for the wine? I think it's really good actually. Yeah. Clean chill wine with it. Yeah, clean fresh. Fantastic. Just like your food. Exactly. Sat? I know. I think what's clever is the play on texture. Mm. Yeah. Is yeah. you get this raw cauliflower with the really soft um, pearl barley, and the fish is cooked to perfection. So well done, Maggie. And I think the wine's.